Whoa. Uh, <laughs> I, this is just cruel. This is vicious. Did, can you see this? What is the cat eating the gnomes? The cat is eating the gnomes. No eating the gnomes, kitty. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody has a sense of humor. <laughs> I love it. <sighs> I listened to what she said. I've learned to listen to the navigator. She said, get out of the coach, get out of the coach. I didn't ask. I just went ahead and stepped on out the door. What is going on guys? We are at Lake Gaston. Lake Gaston RV Resort and Campground. Thousand Trails. Check out that view. And this is our spot right here on the lake. It's probably one of the few spots that was available for us to get. Yeah, pulled right in. Pulled right in. It was available. We had a little bit of time here, a few days. Nice big spots. And you guys will be able to see it in the background as we're walking. And we'll we'll do it that way. Haven't done too much traveling around the campground here. You can see in the background here is uh, uh, annual sites and cabins. So these are the ones that they rent out. But it is pretty spread out and we have decided to take a walk around here and see if we can make a loop. I'm not sure how you yeah. out of that one. They do have sewer sites and uh, we could have opted for one of those sites. But after we found the one there looking over the lake. Yeah, it was so close and such a great view. Why change? There's a yeah. RV site kind of intermixed with the cabins. These cabins are pretty common to the Thousand Trails. We see a lot of them. Uh, in traveling around, uh, town isn't too far away. We were able to find gas in a market and a grocery store. Uh, oh, a Piggly Wiggly. First time we've ever been at a Piggly Wiggly. Who knew? Who knew? Some of this. It is very wooded in here. I don't know what the history of the property is. And we haven't seen uh, any historical sites around the property. But we did on one of the trips out spy something here and I'll show you in just a minute. So hang on, we've got to walk over to them. Down here driving on the way out we noticed a theme and let's see if we can get this little guy in there. How's that? <laughs> now he's just here by himself. Uh, it is a gnome forest. Is that what you call it? I call it a gnome forest. There are little gnome cities and villages uh, at the base of the trees as you go around the park. Oh, but here, here's one right here. And this one actually has lighting. He looks rather comfortable, doesn't he? Taking a little swing. Another gnome village. <laughs> That's so cute. It 
it is. Plant life actually grows up and makes it look like trees around the... I can't see what his sign ran. Reads. They're nothing official. I'm, I think it's probably just other campers setting up yeah, adding to it, you never know. These kind of line the road driving in. And we started seeing it. We thought, oh, we have to mention the gnomes. <laughs> Somebody went through a lot of work. Karen knocked all these out. Oh, over. don't even go there. Oh, you didn't? Actually, she's setting them all back up. Are you going to stand the gnome? He's taking a nap, but he needs to be. He's taking a nap. How about. How about we put here? Okay. There. How's that? <laughs> Whoa. Uh, <laughs> uh, this is just cruel. This is vicious. Did, can you see this? The cat is eating the gnomes. No eating the gnomes, kitty. <laughs> Somebody has a sense of humor. <laughs> I love it. <sighs> and a troll dungeon down there. No, there's no troll down there. There could be, though. And they call it a comfort station slash laundry. Hi, how you doing? Showers. There's the pool. I don't believe they have a hot tub here over here. And this whole area over here is beach area and swimming. There's nobody swimming over there right now. But it looks like uh, there are a few people over there enjoying the beach. The pool, I guess, opens up around Memorial Day, although given the looks of that pool, I don't know if they're going to make it by <laughs> Memorial Day. They're going to have to do some super cleaning. Yeah, I have to do some super cleaning on that. All the pools at Thousand Trails have been pretty, they've been pretty nice, haven't they? Yes. So we were a little disappointed they didn't have a hot tub. We were kind of looking for that. It's like a kind of a gathering pavilion here. Oh, we kind of missed the putt-putt golf here. Yeah, this isn't too bad. Last couple haven't been very impressive. No. No. And it's been the first putt-putt golf that has a lake view. <laughs> so you can enjoy 18 holes of your favorite putt-putt golf. And all the while watching the lake. Thing and yeah, it, it goes and goes. The store does sell gas, and we've seen boats coming in to uh, buy gas. And you can see their business hours don't always match their actual times. <laughs> There's a back deck here. Maybe we can get up there and... I can show you some of the store. Oh yeah. Well, all the lights are turned down in there. They do ice cream. They do hamburgers, hot dogs, wings, fries, huh. tots, chicken tenders, that kind of stuff. And a few items in addition, but you can't beat the view. And uh, we are gonna walk back across because there is actually a path that we can sneak across over there, but you can see the Endeavor over there on the other side. Uh, this walkway looks like it's been rebuilt going back up there, down here. Lots of boat landings going around. So you can come here with your boat. I don't know what they charge for a dock fee. 
I do notice that all of the spots are numbered. There's a party barge for you. Yeah, that's nice. Mm. Right out here on the point. There's a sign. And I'm gonna see if I can talk. Cheese. 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 Eight. Get your arm down. Get my arm down. Oh my god. We need to check out because it is getting darn close to noon and we're pushing it right to the limit. North Carolina has been nice. We've enjoyed it. Beautiful. So we'll see you later guys. Bye guys. Take care. Karen is leaving a rock. I don't think I've, have I gotten to see this rock yet? Did I see, oh yeah, I've seen this rock. We leave these rocks around. If you find a rock, mention it. Make a comment down below and uh, let us know. We always are curious where the rocks end up at. It is, it's starting to rain. We gotta get out of here. We need to dump first and we are out of here. We'll see you guys. Bye. Bye. So, um, Hi guys. tell them what just happened. Okay, so I, we're getting ready to leave here and I just took chance for a walk to go pee and I came back in and started getting ready to go. I walked back, I got all the walls pushed in and uh, sat down in the driver's seat and started the coach. And I'm getting his coffee and I'm coming up front to see how things are going. <laughs> and I go into panic mode and I'm like, get out. Get out of the coach. Get out of the coach. Derek, get out, get out of the coach. At this point, I'd been in the coach for at least a minute or two, and I'm getting ready to leave. And I listened to what she said. I've learned to listen to the navigator. She said, get out of the coach, get out of the coach. I didn't ask. I just went ahead and stepped on out the door. And then what? <laughs> <laughs> he had a lizard on his shoulder. Not a little lizard. But a great big lizard on my shoulder. <laughs> In the coach. No. <laughs> I'm like, get the fuck out of my coach. <laughs> she, was, she was afraid that thing was going to jump off at any point. Anyway, we got to get out of here. The lizard ran. He, he, he. So we are out of here. Good to go. We'll see you guys later. Just figure we show that with you. Bye, guys. Our adventures. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, you get to taste it. You can't taste it. They're good. <sighs> Karen normally likes things in her mouth. I don't know what the problem was. Here. You're gonna take a bath <laughs> with the camera. It's not waterproof. I don't <laughs> 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 Stop being a brat. I you will saw hurt it. you. You saw it, right? You saw it. Stop being a brat. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Don't push me in. That's not even funny. Why not? Because this walkway be isn't very this walkway is not very wide. And you're gonna push me into the water. And our GoPro isn't waterproof no, with this microphone on there. So so stop being a brat. Don't. <laughs> stop being a brat. Don't. Do we need to go over to the point? Squirrel. Squirrel. Squirrel.